Hello everyone. Welcome to the School of Chemistry. Now, today we are having this problem. Okay. This is the compound which we have to give the name. And the major mistake which a lot of students do in this compound is that they take the straight chain. This chain as the parent chain. Okay. Can anybody give me the actual number of carbon atom present in its longest chain? Somebody would answer it is 4. Okay. Somebody would answer it is 5. But the actual number of carbon atoms which are present in the longest chain of this compound is 6. Neither 4 nor 5. It's 6. So now can you easily visualize the number of carbon atoms or the chain having the 6 number of carbon atoms? Actually, actually, the chain is lying over here. So it could be from this. And you can expand the structure and write down the structure once again. Okay. And see the molecule in that. Let me do it for you. So we can write C2H5 as CH2 and CH3. Then we can write this one CH, CH2. CH3 and the last is the CS3. Now everybody can recognize the six carbon chain in this. Okay. Then you have to put a numbering on it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Numbering can be done from either side. That can be done from the right hand side or from the left hand side. No worries. And these two are the substituents. Fine. So any organic compound contains three things in it. Okay. First is the prefix. Second is a word root. And third is a suffix. So prefix over here are the two methyl groups which act as the substituents over here. And their positions are one is lying at carbon three, other is lying at carbon four. So the prefix would be three comma four dimethyl. After that, we have to look for the word root that is a parent chain. That parent chain is made up of how many carbon atom? So as a parent chain is made up of six carbon atom, so we can write hex, hex, and the carbon atoms are linked to each other with a single bond then the primary suffix comes out to be as in. So the compound becomes 3,4 dimethyl hexane. Hope it helps. Thanks.